let's memorize bar 13 to bar 17 of minuet 3. Uh, bar 13 is very set similar to bar 5, that line, so line 2 and line 4 are very similar. The difference is in the ending, um, but let's have a look at that. So we've got low 2 on the A, then 3, 2 slurred, 1, open, ready, go, 2, 3, 2, 1, open, and again, go. Next bar goes 1 on the A, 2, 1, A, 3 on D, ready, go, 2, 1, A, 3, D, and again, so 1 on the A, 2, 1, A, 3, and again, go. And here's where the little contrast happens. Open A, 1 A, 3 on the D, 2 on the D. Ready, go. And again, go. Again, go. And then the last note is Mr. 3 on the D string for three counts. One, two, circle. So let's put two bars together. So we start two on the A string, low two, ready, go. Two, three, two, one, open. One, two, one, A, three. And again, ready, go, two. Next two bar A, one A, three, two, three on the D. Ready, go. Two, circle. Do that again. Ready, go. A. Circle. And again, go. Let's put all four bars together. So low two on the A, ready, go. And one more time. Low two on the A, go. Always build up that melody from the basic melody. So the basic melody is always the first note of each bar in this instance. Two, three, one, two, three, A, two, three, three. It gives you a structure to what you're about to decorate. Now you add the two quavers at the end of each bar. So you have the first note, which is low two, then one, open one, A, three, A, three, two, three. And then add the slur decoration. So, one, 